Have you ever asked yourself, why is your liver so important? Well, for starters, it's the largest organ in the human body. It's also the one that has more vital functions than any other. It gives the skin brightness, processes your blood, your food, creates nutrients, proteins, you name it. All right, we got it. But how on earth can we make sure that the liver is functioning the way it should be? Is there anything we can do specifically to keep it healthy? There's not one thing, but several things you can do. So in today's video, I'm gonna reveal what you need to be doing to keep your liver healthy and guarantee that it's functioning every single day of the year at 100%. Hey guys, Dr. Gus here, naturopath, acupuncturist, conventional doctor, and founder of DrLandivar.com. In this channel, as a conventional doctor to my patients through natural medicine before recurring to the use of pharmaceutical drugs. So if you're new to my channel, consider subscribing and press that bell down below to see notifications and be the first one to watch new video. If you need a line of poor quality supplements for your disease, visit DrLandivar.com and stay till the end of this video, I'm gonna share extra tips and video links related to this topic. We tend to take our liver for granted. Most people ignore that the liver is the one in charge of making our skin look shiny and full of life. It's the organ in charge of keeping our blood clean, our cholesterol in check, and our digestion working properly. Ultimately, the best thing you can do to keep your liver healthy is treat it well. And believe it or not, science still doesn't know how important your liver health can actually be. It all depends on how much effort you put into it. So in today's video, I'm gonna reveal what you need to be doing to keep your liver healthy and guarantee that it's functioning every single day of your life at 100%. Number one, the food you eat needs to be free of toxins. It's important to understand that the liver is the organ in charge of receiving all the food we eat and filtering it. This means that the food we eat has to be healthy, obviously. If you really want to keep your liver healthy, it's absolutely necessary that you start eating healthy always and start to remove all the toxic substances from your diet. So processed foods, for example, which is, are full of colorings, preservatives, chemicals, and oils that are toxic to the liver. The only thing they do is keep a burden on that liver and give it a hard time. Also, you need to stay away from packaged goods like breads, pre-paked foods, and even fast foods. Now, the same thing happens with hydrogenated oils, which can also be toxic. They're known to be toxic. The chemical structure of these oils makes them very hard to digest and slowly affects the liver's natural way of functioning. By the way, the consumption of hydrogenated oils include corn oil, canola, soy, and even sunflower oils all dramatically increase the liver disease or can increase the liver disease by 25% or more. So go ahead and change your food. Start using flaxseed oil, olive oil, coconut oil. Not something that is very common, but something that you should be trying to do every single day. Now, if you do this, I guarantee that your liver will always stay healthy and you will see the effects and you will feel differently the way you are feeling today. If you need a good quality concentrate that has been designed specifically to eliminate toxins from your liver, look for Thistle Essence and Appalizer from Fineland at drlandivar.com. Thistle Essence contains a 50 to 1 concentration of the best herb found in nature for this purpose. Number two, you need more fruits and vegetables. If you want your liver to function properly, foods are the most important ingredient you need. You can't expect your liver to work efficiently if you're eating junk food all the time and you're not eating healthy. It's extremely important that you prioritize foods that will help you remove toxins from your liver. Always remember that improving liver function includes two very important things, eliminating toxins, which was step number one, and eating foods that will help obviously clear that liver from anything or any substance it needs to be eliminated. Now this is why I recommend you start adding more fruits and vegetables to your diet. Organic fruits, for example, or vegetables, are not only gonna be the ones to clean the liver, but also the ones to help it function and detoxify. And also, by the way, you may be needing fermented foods, which also contain probiotics. New studies have discovered that probiotics can aid the liver in its function and some studies propose that can even repair some of the damage or help repair the damage in liver failure. So think about it, probiotics, lots of fruits and vegetables, and foods that are organic that will not damage your liver 
but on the contrary, help it re recover and help it detoxify. If you need something specific that can help you improve all that probiotic content in your body, in your system, look for ProBillion and Thistle Essence from Finland at DrLandivar.com. Number three, drink more coffee. Many common diseases are primarily affecting the liver, including, for example, hepatitis, fatty liver disease, and many others. Cancer is also very common. Now, it only makes sense that you try to help your liver with everything you can before this happens. And coffee is one of them. It's a very popular beverage that you can take every single day. A study published in the Archives of Internal Medicine magazine showed that an increased amount of coffee consumption is associated with lower rates of liver disease progression. Very important people with hepatitis, maybe problems with the liver, fatty liver disease, anything. More specifically, there was a 20% reduction in alcoholic liver syndrome for every cup of coffee a day that participants drank. There's other research that suggests that coffee can also protect you against cirrhosis. And in this category, researchers include also alcoholic cirrhosis, which is worse. People who drink four or more cups per day have up to an 80% lower risk, 80% lower risk of alcoholic liver cirrhosis, which is a lot. This is not mentioning cancer, which coffee has also been seen to delay its progression with the only thing, coffee consumption. So definitely something you should be considering. Coffee is a gem in liver health, and especially if you know how to use it and you don't abuse from it. Number four, do a liver detox from time to time. We definitely need to help our liver function from time to time, and a detox is something that should not be taken lightly. Every pesticide and toxin we eat ends up being accumulated inside our livers, and we need to get it out of there, obviously. I found that the best way to do a liver detox and practice one is done by taking special supplements. It's hassle-free, easy, economic, and you can, you can do it at any time. I recommend you using milk thistle, for example. This herb is considered the king of detoxifying herbs that deals with liver cleanses. Milk thistle helps eliminate buildup of prescription medications, heavy metals, alcoholic toxicity, and even environmental pollutants. Very important. If you need something specific that can help you remove every single thing you need from your liver and at the same time help it function properly, look for Thistle Essence and Appalizer from Finland at DrLandivar.com. Number five, eat lots of celery. Celery is a very powerful vegetable everyone should be consuming. And listen to this. Researchers from the Department of Nutrition and Food Science in Egypt made a study where they fed rats celery. These rats experience a reduction in the amount of dangerous fatty buildup within the liver just with celery consumption, demonstrating that celery is capable of protecting our livers and reducing fat within. I personally prescribe my patients that have a fatty liver or fatty liver disease a juice or maybe celery every day. And it works. They come back telling me that that simple change in the diet made tons of difference. So go ahead and try it. You won't regret it. You won't lose a thing. It's, it's economic, it's cheap, and it's easy to do. And help out the channel by giving a thumbs up and sharing with your friends and family. And if you have any questions, leave your comments down below. We'll be happy to assist you. If you need quality supplements for your disease or a line at a point, it's line .com. And right over here, check out these other videos related to stopping your information that might prevent a serious health condition in the future. Thanks for watching, you guys, and I'll see you soon.